A national foster grandparents program is celebrating 50 years of service. More than one million grandparents have mentored millions of children from coast to coast, including right here in western New York. Reporter Ryan Arbograss shows us the Buffalo strong spirit of these grandparents who help children with their schoolwork and act as mentors for troubled teenagers. The sidewalk, no. the when the first graders in Miss Marin's classroom at Drake Elementary School in North Tonawanda fall behind, they know who to call. We have grandma. This is my sister. This Helen Mott, known to her now hundreds of grandkids as Grandma Helen, is a foster grandparent. And when I go anywhere and any of these children see me, they're hollering, Grandma, Grandma, and the lady in the store one day asked how many grandchildren I had. She's been a familiar face in Niagara County schools for the last 24 years volunteering her time as a part of the Foster Grandparent Mentorship Program. Foster grandparents place seniors inside of classrooms to help teachers and children by being available for one-on-one -on -one help if a child falls behind. Well, I love the children, and it just makes me real happy being with them. And even though these children are only five and six years old, remembering Grandma Helen isn't something they need help with. Oh, they come running back the first day of the next year. They got to run in and make sure you're still here and... They're going to come in each morning and say good morning and hello. And of course, they got to come and give you a morning hug or something before they'll go sit down. Her students are even planning a special surprise for their grandma. We are celebrating her birthday tomorrow. She's going to be 84, so we already have um, a plan. The kids are writing a book for her. Um, so they each wrote a page of something that they feel special is about grandma. So much happy. Really happy. Happiness from the hearts of our Western New York seniors guiding the future of our community. It's the dedication of the nearly 60 foster grandparents that showcases the true power of what it means to be Buffalo strong. I'm gonna go as long as I can. In North Tonawanda, Ryan Arbogast, 7 Eyewitness News. Well, if you were interested in becoming a foster grandparent, you must be age 55 or older. You must be willing to volunteer 15 hours a week. You will receive monthly training and you need transportation to and from school. You can also earn and tax-free stipend to cover costs of serving.